What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, the Kid MMA Expert, and I am back with another video. It's been a long time since I uploaded a, a last video. I know I've been busy, but yeah, I'm sorry for not uploading. But let's just get right into the video, and I'm gonna be talking about why Nate Diaz will destroy Jorge Masvidal if the fight happens, which I think it will happen. Maybe Master Square Garden. I'm hoping maybe, uh, maybe Master Square Garden, maybe uh, 245. Maybe in the beginning of next year, but yeah, that's not the point of the video. My point is that Nate Diaz will destroy Jorge Masvidal in the video. And it's kind of funny because I just picked Nate Diaz for this rank fight and this guy picked Masvidal when we're talking about Masvidal versus Diaz. So that's pretty funny and that's pretty, I mean, that's pretty good, I guess. <laughs> that's my lucky day, but yeah, let's get right into it. Nate Diaz in his last fight against Anthony Pettis. This man was intelligent, man. He wasn't just throwing shots. He doesn't. He wasn't just throwing reckless shots in Anthony Pettis' face. And he was intelligent. He was waiting for right openings. He was uh, initiating the clinch a lot. He was uh, even taking Pettis down, which is very rare on Diaz brothers. Which I know they have the wrestling abilities, but they just never go for really go for takedowns since yeah they like the uh, brawling style of fights, you know. But yeah, against Anthony Pettis, he was intelligent, man. And I think against Masvidal, he's gonna stay intelligent like that again. And he's gonna try to take it to the ground. Obviously, he has an advantage on the ground against Masvidal. I mean, Masvidal isn't really known for his uh, ground game, so yeah, I think he's gonna try to take it to the ground again. And yeah, I feel like he's gonna completely destroy him there. I mean, Masvidal is not known for ground game or ground defense, like we've seen against Damian Maya. Uh, Damian Maya, he got taken down and, you know, he lost him, you know, but uh, even against Ben Askren, I mean, we never got to really see his takedown defense. The fight was so quick. So, yeah, I'm not really sure about Masvidal's uh, takedown defense. I don't know if it's the best, which I don't think it is. And, yeah, he's probably going to have trouble against Nate Diaz on the ground. I mean, Nate Diaz, man, he's a, a Brazilian uh, jiu-jitsu black belt. I mean, this man can submit anybody from any position, man. I mean... Yeah, he's just a master on the ground. So, my prediction is Diaz by decision. I mean, I don't. Masvidal is too tough to be finished. I mean, yeah, he does, doesn't really get finished. And yeah, I don't see him getting finished against Diaz. I mean, but I think Diaz goes for takedowns intelligently, picks the right shots against Anthony, like Anthony Pettis, and gets the decision win. I mean, 30 27, the shutout, like Anthony Pettis, against Anthony Pettis. Yeah, that was my prediction, and hope y'all enjoyed the video. Make sure you smash the thumbs up button if you enjoyed, and I'm sorry for not uploading for a while. You know, I'll try to keep it uh, consistent now, and yeah, that's it. I'll enjoy the gameplay. I'll keep it on. It's Masvidal versus Diaz, like the fight I was talking about, and yeah, I'll see you next time. Peace. Haunt him a little bit. This is where Nate Diaz, man. This is Stockton experience. I love this style of fights so much.
<laughs> what a knockout by Nate Diaz. Yeah, his pressure against Masvidal, I forgot to mention, but it's going to be too much, man. I mean, his pressure is unbelievable. Masvidal is not really known for pressure. And Diaz will just walk him down, try to take him down if he can. And just even on stand-up, I think he beats him every way. He beats him by pressure. He initiates the clinch. He lands him nice elbows and knees. And yeah, he takes the fight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mugliotta has called a stop to this contest at 2 minutes, 35 seconds of round number 2. Declaring the winner by knockout, Nate Diaz! Alright guys, that's it. Peace out.